So there you have it guys, Burton RB1, Newcastle United 2, 3 points going for Newcastle United, they remain top of the championship going into the Christmas break, 49 points overall, who would have thought it, still top of the table, regardless of what Brighton do later, but um, hard walk victory overall, Burton Albion took the game to Newcastle United, Newcastle United only made two, two changes in this lineup. Yed Lin coming in, and of course Atsu starting. Finally, Atsu gets a chance. Um, did he take it? Mm. I'll leave that one up to my match report later on. But um, yeah, Newcastle United slowly got into this game, but they were on the front foot for the majority of the game, I would have to say. We still did take the lead overall though, which is a great low cross up there. Fantastic ball by Shelby, found him on the left wing, crossed it in low, and then obviously Gale was there to, to tap it home for his 17th goal of the season already. But an Adam got pretty much straight back into it four minutes later, um, pretty much a carbon copy of what we did basically out on the right, um, crossed in, basically the Newcastle United defence should have cut it out, but it fell to Lloyd Dyer, and then obviously went on to score uh, and equalise four minutes later. After that, Newcastle United basically took the game to him again, um, went close with a couple of chances, but uh, that man Diame again, what a week that he's had him. Um, found edge of the area, out muscled his defender and uh, went in 2-1 to the good at half time. After that, no change were made, but it was Byron St. Albion who came out the blocks all guns blazing, 100 miles an hour, both sides, to be honest, but again, Burton Albion came out of there, came out of the blocks, should I say, all guns blazing, and they should have, should have had maybe a penalty in the 90th minute or around that time, but all in all, ugh, great performance by both sets of teams. Probably in the second half, I would have to say, best chance fell to them, with Aikins who blasted out of the bar, Gale had a good chance that fell to him after a great ball by Diarme, but a gritty victory overall and as I said before three points is all that counts. After the game speaking to both managers Nigel Clough was uh, very complimentary of Newcastle United says it's pretty much a two horse race between Newcastle United and Brighton. Obviously he looks forward to playing Aston Villa very soon and obviously Rafa Benitez was in for a shout uh, in for a battle per se and uh, he got a battle but he's happy with the performance overall especially from the armor as well. But yeah thank you for listening guys Stay tuned for my full match report coming out later on this evening or this weekend. See you later. Peace.